A yes vote today is a vote against the tourism economy that so many people in this state have worked so hard to build. A yes vote today is a vote against PPAC. A yes vote today is a vote against Trinity. A yes vote today is against the Blackstone Valley tourism. A yes vote today is against the GAM Theater in Pawtucket. Because if you don't think that when people come to Rhode Island that they're not going to go to a casino and they're going to care less about what's showing at the GAM or at PPAC, that's what you're voting today. You're voting against the tourism industry. You're voting also, more importantly, against all the things that so many people, Mayor Cicilline and others, have worked so hard on building a knowledge economy, trying to show this state as something that's special, something where young innovators will come and build their businesses and grow their businesses, you want to cheapen us, make us Vegas. There's no difference between casinos and Vegas. They all have different gates, but a Vegas casino is no different from a New Orleans casino or a Florida casino or any other casino. This is just another casino. And that's what you're voting for. Why? Because Massachusetts might put in a casino. That's why you're voting it. You're voting against small business reform. You're voting against making the hard decisions that we've made this session count. I urge you, from the bottom of my heart, to vote no on this. I know some of you feel we have to do this. I'm telling you, the only thing you're doing today is voting to put an act in front of this General Assembly next year to fill in the details. That's what you're doing. And if you think it stops at the footprint, you're wrong. They'll be back. They'll be back for more. They'll be back in Lincoln. They'll be back in Newport because those buildings aren't going to stop them. And we don't have a fiscal note on this. Again, we could lose $100 million, people are saying. We could lose $50 million if we don't have table games. But how many machines are they going to take out? They give an estimate how many machines they're going to take out to put those table games in. How much revenue is that going to generate? No one knows. How, what is the percentage going to be? Who are the owners going to be? No one knows. There are many questions unanswered. You are voting to throw something out and say, Let's take a chance. Well, isn't that what gambling is? If you want to take a chance on all the good things that we've done this session, all the good things that we've done in Rhode Island, then hit that green tonight. If you're not a gambler, hit the red. Thank you.